Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 30th of September 1935, the Hoover Dam was dedicated by President Franklin D. Roosevelt. Originally known as the Boulder Dam, the 726 foot, that's 220 meter high construction, was built in Black Canyon on the Colorado River to control floods and provide both irrigation water and hydroelectric power for the developing southwest. Situated on the Arizona-Nevada border, the US Bureau of Reclamation originally proposed the construction of a dam in 1922, but it was another six years before President Coolidge signed the bill that authorised it. Within a year of the dam's approval, America was plunged into the Great Depression. Thousands of unemployed people came to Nevada in the hope of securing a job on the project. The population of nearby Las Vegas mushroomed, but those who secured jobs with six companies, the consortium that won the construction contract, were moved to Boulder City that had been built to house workers. Work on the dam began in spring 1931, the first major task being the creation of diversion tunnels to direct the Colorado River away from the construction site. Following the construction of two enormous coffer dams, the canyon was then drained and the surrounding rocks stabilised, ready for work to begin on the dam itself. The first concrete was poured 18 months ahead of schedule. In order to avoid uneven cooling and contraction, the wall was constructed of separately poured columns that contained pipes through which cold water would be pumped. By the time concrete pouring ended in May 1935, a total of three and a quarter million cubic yards had been used. With the majority of the work complete, the dam was dedicated by President Roosevelt on the 30th of September 1935, in front of a crowd of 10,000 people. Thank you.